Even though Helene is long gone from Florida, it is still wreaking havoc. Officials say salt water is causing electric vehicles to catch fire. Pinellas County near Tampa shared this video today. It did not say when and where it was taken, but it urged residents who evacuated to contact them so the fire department can check on their cars. Fox's Haley Hines reports. Water and the uh, ion batteries do not mix, and they literally explode. And they did across the city of Tampa. You heard horns honking all in the distance because the cars were shorting out. Andrew Eleanor heard an explosion while hunkering down on Davis Island. The lithium battery, it got inundated and then blew up. And this was the aftermath, a charred electric vehicle surrounded by debris after the water rushed in. And because of the flooding that we've had, we've had some uh, lithium ion situations. It wasn't the only fire. This one was along Blanca Street. Except in this case, Tampa's mayor says a fire likely started by an electric car spread to the home. It was gutted by morning. Nothing left. Saw that home from the helicopter and there's one wall left. So it's a very, very tragic. Fortunately, no one was hurt. A similar story in Seminole Heights. Tampa firefighters worked for hours to put this one out. Neighbors say water got in the garage with an electric car inside and a fire broke out. While it's unclear if the car was to blame, this serves as a warning for other owners. If you have any equipment, any scooters, any uh, bikes, electronic bikes, electrical vehicles that have been submerged in salt water. Please, please do not try to power that on. Haley Hines, Fox News.